Hi, this is Dylan from Dylan Chappelle Architects. In today's video, we are going to discuss four simple tips on how to get your project approved by the Architectural Review Board in the city of Carpinteria. How do you know if your project requires design review? A few conditions that trigger design review would be any new construction, second story additions, and major alterations to the front of your home. It's always a good idea to start talking with the planning staff early in the design phase so there are no surprises down the road. After making countless design review presentations, I'd like to share with you these four simple tips to make sure your plan gets approved. Number four, always make sure to consider the privacy and existing view corridors of your neighbors. Number three, the material, color, and composition of all sides of your building should be in harmony with each other. Architectural elements and details should be carried around all sides of the building, creating a consistent and unified composition of the exterior. Number two, when a garage fronts the street, the width of the garage should not be more dominant than the house. And number one, the size, scale, and form of your building and the placement on the parcel should be compatible with the adjacent nearby properties and with the dominant neighborhood or district development pattern. How can you make sure your next design review goes smoothly? The answer is a great design system that is professional, incorporates the required design guidelines, and rallies design support from your neighbors. Great design is beautiful, practical, cost effective, and saves time. Great Design begins when we start talking. You can download the Great Design system from our website along with other helpful guides to enhance the results of your next project. This was four simple tips to a great design. I hope it was helpful.